This question on the SAT is not even in English. If one half of A times one half of A times one half of A is equal to one over 64, then A is equal to what? So first thing we wanna do is multiply the one halves. So we have one half times one half times one half. That's gonna give us one over eight. And for A, A times A times A is just gonna give us A to the third power over one. We put these together and we have A to the third over eight. Now after that, we're gonna equate this to one over 64. And now the denominators are not the same. So our goal is to get them to the same so we can compare them. So to go from eight to 64, we gotta multiply this side by eight, which would give us 64. But we, what we do to the bottom, we also need to do to the top. So on the top, we have eight times a to the third is equal to one over 64. Now the bottom is the same, so now we can compare the top. So if we have eight times a to the third is equal to one, and we divide both sides by eight, we would get a to the third power is equal to one eighth. Now what number times itself three times is gonna get to one eighth? If we multiply one by itself three times, that's gonna give us one. If we multiply two by itself three times, that's gonna give us eight. If we multiply four by itself three times, that's gonna give us 64, so it must be C.